Okay, guys. So, we did the Toon Chaos Pack box last time. But this time, pretty sure you guys noticed the date and everything. I'm really excited because we are opening up not one, not two, but three boxes of Battles of Legend the Armageddon that just got released today. Um, which I believe in this set, uh, I've got to double check to see if it's Japanese exclusive. But there is a 10,000 uh, secret rare 10,000 dragon, um, uh, I believe, amongst this pack that is currently priced anywhere between 1,500 and bids all the way up to uh, 10,000 on some marketplaces. So, wish me luck. We didn't get so lucky on Toon Chaos, but for this one, uh, and then not to mention for my light swords, I've been in need of a nice judgment dragon so it'll be nice to at least pull that so i believe in this video we might do three different parts just because last time it took about uh 25 minutes to get the other video done so i might break this up into three separate videos so break it out also of course got my stack of orange covers here which you know you'd think that if i went to a card store and bought this that i would probably also get like the hard protective sleeves but i didn't think of that till I was already halfway home, so here we go. I think I might just start a collection of uh box <laughs> like the booster boxes. <laughs> All right, let's. Oh, shiny! So shiny! I love it. I love it so much. All the different arts. Now, this is a five card pack but each one is a uh, i believe an ultra rare so that's cool uh obviously because so many are ultra rare that they're not going to actually be worth that much uh but i do believe that um chaos or uh emperor chaos dragon or chaos emperor dragon um i believe that one and the 10,000 rarity 10,000 dragon is uh the two highest uh priced cards in here so Let's go for booster one. Since these are all going to be um, ultra rares, uh, I'm probably not going to do our thing that we did last time. Wait, are these actually all secret rares? Wait, hold on. Did I already get a secret rare? Hell yeah, look at that. Oh yeah, oops, we had to do this last time. I got you guys, I got you. So. We're going to come up just a little bit. And we are going to zoom in. Oop. Okay. So. Um, yeah, so we got Glacial Beast Blizzard Wolf, which actually seems to be a secret rare. That's cool. Um, I wonder if it's actually supposed to be the one secret rare and four ultra rares. I think that's what it was. Let me double check. Um, five cards per pack. Nope, doesn't doesn't say if there's a. All right, cool. So we already got a secret rare off the bat. So that's pretty dope. Then we have Artifact Sanctum, Elemental Hero Neos Chaos or Chaos Neos, um, Appliancer Test, and Fire Flint Lady. So I'm already super excited that we got a secret rare. Now, obviously, you know we'll we'll be able to find out um, how. The rest of it is once Ugh, this damn corner. Try that. Ha ha. Flip it around. All right. So just like last time, we're gonna put our stack here. No one secret rare. So let's so let's actually try to figure out if uh if it is one secret rare per pack. Ooh, I don't like it. Ah oh, man. I need to figure out a better way to open these. All right. Okay, okay. See, so, so I did get just a little too high. So it does seem to be a, uh, one secret rare in every pack, which this one we got Glacial Beast uh, Polar Penguin. We got Goyo Defender, uh, Appliancer Reuse, Cross Sheep, and Flower Cardian Cherry Blossom. So awesome. I'll definitely, uh, since, like I said, since all these are ultra rares, I'll probably put the value of all of these secret rares down in the uh in the video and in the description and stuff. Oh my god. 
I hate these orange sleeves. I'm going to end up messing up a card. Okay. Oh, man. Now, if I could get that red out, that'd be nice, too. I wonder, like, how do you guys open up your packs? I've seen some people do, like, some crazy thing like this, which does not freaking work. Yeah, I'm just going to butcher this pack. Oh, please don't have a really good card in here. I'm going to feel so bad. All right. So. Whoa. All right. Woo! Powered Crawler. That's pretty cool. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, that is Secret Rare. Okay. So, we got Powered Crawler. We have Appliancer Socket Roll. Socket Troll. Psychic Wave. Appliancer Celta. What? Celtipus? Um, Mecha Phantom Beast O Lion. Not gonna lie, even if all of these uh ultra rares like don't really have high values to them, it's still nice to have like ultra rares in your deck. Like if you can have a deck of all ultra rares, that would be pretty sweet. I know there's probably a bunch of pro players that have a crap ton of these. Alright. Um this one. Dude, I love how all of these have like badass dragons on the covers. Okay. Ooh, see, that's how I normally Fossil Dragon Skull Gear. Skull Gear? So I did see that um, in Konami's video explaining the Fossil Dragons that it really seems like they have really good synergies. And I mean, obviously, you know, there's stuff that will easily counter it, but it just looked really nice on how there's different variations that you can make this almost OTK like within a turn or two. So Fossil Fossil Dragon Skulger. We got Four Mud Skipper. Appliancer. Uh, was that? Uh, I'm not gonna pronounce that. Uh, Elemental Hero Shining Wingman. Nice. Uh, Numeron Gate BB. That's cool. Um, there's also another. Uh, um, what you call it? Another. Um, people always just want to say meta. Um, hard type. Not Fossil Dragon, but it's another one that's in here. I think it starts with a C. I'll recognize it when I see it. But those also looked really nice, too. So, I don't know. I feel like between this, opening the Tomb Chaos, and then um, last time when I opened up a bunch of uh, Heroes Revenge, I think I might do uh, something. Chimera Tech Mega... <laughs> this looks so cool. Chimera Tech Mega Fleet Dragon. Invoked Raijin. Raijin. Assault Blackwing, Sohaya, yeah, the Rainstorm, we got Junk Anchor, and Secure Guard. So, um, like I said, I'm going to probably do the, uh, the price listings on these, just because uh, I think there are a bunch of new cards in this set that were never in Yu-Gi-Oh! before. They were in the anime, but they weren't in the actual game. So... Alright. So I feel like I broke the cycle. Broke my pattern, man. Broke my pattern. I'm hoping we don't get too many cards, but... Ooh! Number F0. Topic. Future Slash. That's pretty cool. Malefic Paradigm, Paradigm Dragon. Dude, I've always liked Mo like Mo Malefic bad. Uh, Numeron Gate. Yeah, I think it was the Numerons. I think that's the one I'm... Ra's Disciple. Ooh! Ooh! God card. All right, cool. So we got some God card synergy in here. Yeah, I'm still not sure. I'll probably, yeah, I'm probably going to have to look up exactly which ones were meant for um, the ones that were originally in the anime and that are new to the set. Or I, I don't think this entire set is, uh, is brand new, but uh, we're just going to keep going, man. The fact that I got two more boxes after some freaking for it. Uh! Woo! All right, number C92, Heart Earth Chaos Dragon. Now I'm going to have to double check because I don't know if that brain fart. I don't know if that spelling of Earth with uh, a large capital H is normal. Um, Honestly, I know that card's been around for a while, but I just don't remember it. I'm going to have to look that up. That's a misprint. God, that would be awesome. 
All right, so we got Chaos Neos again. Numeron Gate. Ooh, that's a different Numeron Gate. Blackwing, nice. Um, so I know last time I talked about uh, hybrid uh, tunes and zombies and uh, tunes and dragons. And, uh, and uh, zombies and blue eyes was another good one. Um, dude, I really hate these sleeves. I'm going to have to switch to the reds. Oh, my God. Guys, don't watch. Just look away. Look away. We got a sensor. This is atrocious on how these sleeves are treating my cards. <laughs> um, but uh, one that I also made before was a chaos deck, but more or less using light swords and black black wings as um like a hybrid thing. Invocation, nice, I like it. Okay, again another paradigm dragon, <laughs> appliance or laundry dragon. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Uh, number four, Numeron Gate. <laughs> okay. Uh, ooh, we got an Invoke. Damn, that looks that looks really cool. Sorry if I'm not showing the art well enough. I need to pay attention. I'm getting too excited right now. Still have not gotten my Judgment Dragon, so I'm still a little sad. All right. Do do do. -do. We're eleven minutes in. And I'm not sure if we're halfway yet. Numeron Network. Okay, so see, this is like one of the ones that, that Konami showcased um, in this set with in combination of this plus the other Numeron cards. Um, like all the Numeron XYZs or whatever. I mean, a lot of you probably already know what this is because, again, I I haven't kept up with this in a while. i just actually just been catching up in the last couple of days. But... Um, like the Numeron XYZs, like you can get them all out pretty much, like almost simultaneously. And like you attack, and even if that one fails, it won't be destroyed. But all of these ones' attacks will double. You attack, it won't be destroyed. All of those ones double. So eventually, you'll get all of your monsters to like practically four to 8,000 attack a piece in one turn. So that is awesome. I really want to make a Numeron deck just because of that. Oh, look, we got Neos Alias. Nice. Afterglow, excellent. Boost Warrior. Which, by the way, for those of you who don't know, I believe this uh, this uh, this card set is uh, ninety or ninety four. I think I'm pretty sure it's. 90. And um, there's a lot of a uh, lot of. Oh God, man! I just I, I'm gonna keep repeating myself because I'm uh, so excited. My girl's probably in the background. Like, God, this guy's such a nerd. So here we go again. All right, so yeah, <laughs> awesome. Okay, so now we got a fossil warrior skull bone, which I think, I hope, I think it's skull king, but I know one of the the fossil warriors are pretty pretty um pricey right now, so that'd be really cool if that's one of them. Uh, so then we have intruder alarm. We have four mud skipper. We got another numeron number four, and galaxy worm. Yeah, I think I'm totally going to try to make a, a, a Numeron deck, which I definitely don't have any other Numeron cards, so I hope that Numerons are new, because no, <laughs> at least I know that I'll probably have at least all of the Numeron cards. Oh man, I just, oh, I am so excited, man, I still got two more boxes. Ah! All right. All right, so we got another Future Slash, so that's cool. Um... Honestly, I've never used Future Slash before. I didn't even know that they had, like, number F0 and, like, F1 and stuff. I have F1. Uh, Appliance or Kappa Scale. Ooh, Brotherhood of Fire Fist. The Lion Emperor. Damn, that was Ooh. Kawaki. Okay. Or Kawa Kawaki. Oh. I never liked those ones. So, oh, oh. Hold on, how many do we have here? Let's check. I don't want to mess this up. We got six, and we got seven. Okay, okay. So we are on this one. All right, see, we got a Judgment Dragon pack. Better have a Judgment Dragon in here. Give me a Judgment Dragon. 
guess maybe put the other one of these up. I can just nope. Okay, try it's trying me, dudes. All right, miracle rupture. Okay, nice. Why not send a level four lower rock monster from your deck to the graveyard? Then if fossil fusion, nice. All right, so we got another Numeron. I'm pretty sure I have all of them now. Um, let's see, we got Shining Flare Wingman again. Okay, invoked Kaliga, Kaliga, Kaliga. However you guys pronounce it. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. I'm going to be really bummed if, like, all of these secrets that I've already pulled are garbage. It'd be very sad. Oh, I think uh, the other one from this set that's also really good is um, they brought back uh, just the standard Utopia. So that'd be really nice. Numeron Calling. Awesome. So we got another Numeron card. Sweet. Again, that appliance or electric. Yeah. Um, Obedient Schooled. Nice. Invoke Liga again. Numeron Wall. See, I'm getting a lot of Numeron. See, this makes me happy because, like, I don't know. I, I hope that uh, that the Numeron setup that they showcased wasn't just like one of those niche type of situations. So I really hope that it. I've always liked like my Banish deck that I have. It literally can. Well, actually no, because I think Grinder Golem's banned now. So um, I mean, it literally you you'd be able to get rid of all the monsters. You'd be able to just stab at life points with dynamite you'd be able to deck out your opponent you'd be able to use grand maju like i had a lot <laughs> yes i got fossil warrior skull king oh man i'm i'm pretty sure this is one of the one of the better ones so this is this is an awesome pull i'm i'm really glad to get that so that means i'm gonna go for numerons and fossil warriors um appliancer copy book black whirlwind got it see Book of Moon? Hell yeah, dude. I missed a lot of these cards. Um, but yeah, like my, my Banish deck, it had several different ways that you could win. It wasn't just like a stall out troll deck. Like I can literally in one play, um, I can deck out my opponent. I can just damage their life points. I can attack direct. I mean, there was like so many different ways. All right. Ooh. La Dolce Angeli. And Angeli, Angeli, um, appliance or copy boat. Oh, bolt buckle. Um, another Numeron. Ooh, Salomon, great sunlight wolf. See, I hate. I'm not a fan of pendulums, but I really like the the art. And then we have a very long one. Uh, it's a bunny. I'm just, it, it's a bunny. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not messing with that too much. All right, so after this box, um, before I start making the video for the second box, uh, we are going to look up all the pricing, and uh, fingers crossed. Do -do, do -do, do -do. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Another Warrior Skull King. Man. <laughs> I have such high hopes. I really hope this thing's good. Dragon Buster Destruction Sword. Oh, yeah, that's for Buster Blader. Nice. Intruder Alarm. Numeron Wall again. Goyo Guardian. Oh, man. Everybody knows how broken Goyo Guardian is. Cough, cough. Damn. Actually, I haven't even checked the, the recent damage. Or I did. I skimmed over it. I didn't pay attention if Goyo was limited or not. But that's cool. All right. So, recapping, we got four. We got four. All right. So, Judgment Dragon again. <sighs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Have my card. Have my card. Whoa. All right. And the flip. <gasps> For the love of Jesus. Please tell me. Chaos Emperor, the Dragon of Armageddon. Secret rare. Actually, yeah. Chaos Emperor, the Dragon of Armageddon. Oh my god. I mean, I know that's not 10,000 dragon, but 
I'm pretty sure. What is it? Woo! Is that the median price? <sighs> oh my god. Yo, what? What's the highest bid on it? Are you on TCG? Um, you should be able to actually go to the card page. Um, I can I can pull it up real quick. Oh my god, no fucking way. Excuse me for any Yeah, yeah, secret rare. And you have to make sure that the uh the abbreviation code for it is the B L A R. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Uh... <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Best pull so far. Oh my god. So I'm g we'll we'll double check on how the listings go, but so far my my girlfriend looked up that this card is around fifty to fifty seven dollars. Is that what it was? So like fifty seven? Woo! Oh my god. Holy shit. Uh honestly out of any pull that I've ever had ever. I think the other uh, most expensive card I have, which I pulled for Christmas, was like a $30 card. Ooh, oh, my God, dude. My heart is racing. <laughs> that is legit. Uh, buy a whole nother box of that. <laughs> so we got Danger, Jackalope, which that's secret rare. And then, of course, Neos Alias. Cicada King. I believe he was a good one, too. Book of Moon and Topologic Zero Bros. We're running out of sleeves, man. I'm gonna have to just start taking my deck stuff out of sleeves. At least before I look this up. Actually, I could do it to some of the Tune Chaos because after we saw the pricing on some of those, we're pretty much straight on those. Oh my god. Holy hell. Oh man, this is so good right now. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna do I feel like I feel like this this flip is great for drama. Dark Spell Regeneration. Nice, nice. Not bad, not bad. Appliance or Sock Control again. Oh, Super All In. That's a new one. Uh, Top Logic and Goyo Guardian. That's cool. I feel like Goyo's just always been like a staple Synchro Monster. And I know there's going to be a lot of people that are going to hate it, but I mean, I'm not. Everybody agrees Synchros are stupid. XYZs are even more stupid. Synchros are. Oh shit. Dude, there's that's that's insanity. I know I'm geeking over a fifty dollar card, but that's come on, that's a fifty dollar card. Alright, specimen inspection. Nice, nice. Black whirlwind. Necros of gun gunnier. Appliance vacu vacuita felon. <laughs> it's an elephant. And then galaxy worm again. Alright, so we're getting down actually. We have four packs left. And I have three sleeves. So, I am going to have to snag a sleeve out of one of my other boxes. So we're going to have to uh, give this just a moment right after. Oh my god, guys. This is nuts. <laughs> this is so nuts. Uh-oh. Sorry, my son's in the background and a little bit of pain. <laughs> All right, so we got a Polar Penguin again. All right, cool. So now I think this is like our first actual dupe. Or no, well, no, we got Skull King too. Uh, Salomon Great Gazelle, Alliance or Kappa Scale, Penguin Tornado, and we got Mara Drago. All right. Oh, my God. Like, that is so legit. I don't know, like, if... <laughs> I don't know. If I could make something with Chaos... I I may not even sell him. Like that's that's honestly probably one of my favorite pulls. Oh, but he's a pendulum. <laughs> All right, and wow. elemental hero Escrudio. Ooh, and I honestly don't know how much um it affects any rarities. If I can get this to focus. Yeah, it's not going to focus too well. So on the like R-I-D-A-O part, 
Um, there's actually like some already what looks to be some kind of wear and tear or like misprint ink or something on there. So I don't know if that affects rarity in a good way or a bad way, but that's really cool. So super all in. Oh look, we got Bambi. Appliancer and evoked. Okay. <sighs> All right, so go for. Well, actually, no, I'll do it on the last one. Okay. Ah, that... <sighs> right out. It's funny because I've always just. I mean, everybody agrees. Dragons, period. No matter what meta you're running, dragons are stupid strong. I got judgment. Yeah, <laughs> that's awesome. So I got judgment, the dragon of heaven. Okay, so that wasn't an actual judgment dragon. That, all right, cool. That's still dope as hell. Oh my god, that's cool. I'm gonna have to look that up too. So we got Brotherhood, Fire Fist, Lion Emperor again. Oh no, he's hurting. Psychic Wave, Ra's Disciple, and Appliance Fire. All right, so we got about to get this last pack. I'm gonna probably throw up my favorite cards that we pulled and um obviously the most expensive which so far i'm pretty sure is the uh the end bam okay here we go last pack of the first box last pack of first Okay, so have it face down a little bit. Bring it on out. And Weathering Soldier. That's a new one too. Cool beans. So we got Weathering Soldier, which okay, yeah, that that is I don't know why it looked some of them don't look like they have the uh Okay, yeah. Awesome. So I'm pretty sure we have all the numerons. Um I believe it was just one through four, so that's really cool that we happen to get all of those as well as uh, the Numeron's field card and uh, one of the uh, spell cards for it. So, all right, now we're going to lay out um, a bunch of these. Uh, I'm just going to pull out the ones that I am most excited for. And then I'm going to explain them. So, obviously this isn't all the ones that we got, but we did get two Fossil Warrior Skull King. We got a Fossil Warrior Skull Bone, Fossil Dragon Skull Gear, Numeron Calling. Oops, let's actually add a get back in here. So, Numeron Calling, Numeron Network, which is the field card. Then we got Heart Earth Dragon, which again, honestly, I'm pretty sure it's just my, my sheer ignorance. I'm not sure if the H is supposed to be capital or if that was a misprint. If so, this might actually have really decent value to it. I'm not too sure. Um, I'm not a professional in grading or anything, but that would be fantastic if that's the case. So don't shit on me for being an Uber or anything like that. I promise I'm not. I'm just catching back up to all this again. And then, of course, we got a Synchro Judgment Dragon, which I'm really excited for. Whether or not it has the same effect as Judgment Dragon, um, it's honestly just one of my favorite cards, period. Like, I've always loved Light Swarms, and I love Judgment Dragon. But, Big Daddy, Chaos Emperor, the Dragon of Armageddon. The dude who is literally on the cover, center of the box. So we got this guy, and we got this guy on the box. We don't have the red eyes yet, but we got Big Bad Voodoo Daddy right here in the middle. And my girl said that he's probably somewhere around like 50, 60 bucks or something like that. So... That right there is a phenomenal pull in my opinion. Of course, again, I haven't pulled any like thousand dollar cards or anything like that, but as a guy coming back to the game and back to the collection, this honestly like has me so hyped right now. So I love you guys. Thank you whoever's watching. Thank you whoever supports me being an idiot and sounding like a dummy. But um, these are my favorite cards that we pulled. Obviously, you know, we have all of these secret rares too. Um, I'm like I said, I'm gonna go back through when I uh, chop up the video, price them out, and let you guys know uh, if we made out like a bandit or if we didn't. More than likely, this guy right here brought us up in the positives, so that's really great. Um, and yeah, so I appreciate you guys. 
stick around for the second part, which will be box number two. And um, yeah, see you guys in a minute. Deuces.